Hello guys, welcome back to Guitar Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix. Internet is very slow on your iPhone 15 Pro Max, 15 Pro. So as you can see here I have connected the Wi-Fi as well as the cellular data. But when I'm using both, I'm having a lot of trouble because uh, you know it get a lot of time to get loaded up. The internet is very slow and I'm not able to do anything. So if that is the case which is happening for you guys, then how we can fix this up? So let's move to the workaround one by one. The first one is all about you have to check whether you are having the internet plan or not. You should be having the internet plan, which means if you're not on the Wi-Fi as well as on the mobile data, you have to make sure that if you're connected to the Wi-Fi, the Wi-Fi provider, that is the, uh, you know, uh, the receiver should provide you the internet connection. So uh, the package should not be exhausted. At the same time, if you're using the mobile data, you should be having enough package or else you'll be having the trouble. So I know this sounds a little odd, but even though you have to cross check this as the first one, this is not a big thing. Just cross check yourself whether your data has been used up or not. If that is not the case, we have to move to the second one. Second one is all about you have to check the internet bandwidth. That is very important. So I'm not recommending you guys that you have to cross check because, because for most users when they're using the internet, you know, the bandwidth has to be automatically correct. So you don't have to focus much on this. You have to cross check whether you are having an issue with the bandwidth or you should be cross checking yourself that you're having enough data package or else you'll be having the trouble. Third one is all about nothing but we have to disable the background task. For this, we just need to go over here in the settings. Now from here, go to the Wi-Fi. And from here, first tap on this particular eye icon over there. Let me tap on the eye icon. Just tap on the eye icon. Now from here, you can see the low data mode. This should be turned off. Because if it is turned on, we have to turn this on. And once afterwards, we go back. Now if you're on the mobile data as well, just tap on the mobile service. Now from here, what we need to do is, if you scroll down, you can see these are the things which is utilizing your internet so you have to uh, you know uh, turn off the unwanted things because they might be using a lot of your internet that is why you're having the slow so you have to cross check whether you have to provide the internet to all these kind of things for example i'm having the uh, fiber which i don't use much i have to turn this off so uh, you have to cross check yourself any other uh, shopping online thing which you uses a lot so you have to cross check whether all these things are actually utilizing in the background so that you are having this issue. You have to do the same for the, both the mobile data as well as for the Wi-Fi. So once you cross check this, you need to check after whether this the issue is solved or not. Still, if you are having the issue, we have to move to the fourth step. That is all about we have to reset the DNS network. That is what we have to do. So just tap on the settings once again, tap on the Wi-Fi frame we have to tap over here in this icon now from here we have to scroll down and navigate to configure ip just tap on the configure ip and right now as you can see this is automatic you have to set this to manual now go for ip address now over here you have to set the value that you have to uh, set the value for example at the same time you have to keep in mind if you can also just you can tap on the dns that is configured dns now from here you can see this is automatic, you have to change this to manual so that you will be getting the add server option. So these are already connected. Now I have to go for add server, just tap on the add server. Here I have to give four digit value. So you can try giving the value that is 8844 type 8844. We can also give this particular value and also you can give one more that is nothing but 8888. So you can also try giving 888. So once you give this, you can save it. So, but uh, I'm gonna uh, remove it because that's not necessary because uh, this is how you can remove it. So I'm having a good internet connection that is fine for me. So just add a new server by giving the value 8844-8888. And once you give the value, you have to check whether you are able to fix the issue or not. If you're still having the issue by loading up, you can try with the Safari, you can try with the Instagram, you can try with the WhatsApp and you have to cross check whether you're having an issue or not. Next one is all about even after trying with this, if you're having the issue, you can try the fifth step. The fifth step is all about we have to turn off private address. So tap over here on the settings once again. Now go to the Wi-Fi over here. Now tap on the eye icon over here. Now from here, there is an option called a private Wi-Fi address. You have to turn this off, which is very important. Turn this off. After this is turned this off, you have to check whether you are having the issue whether it is not loading up or not. If you're having an issue with loading up, as you can see, you have to move to the next step as well. Next step is all about nothing, but we have to do a reset network settings. Tap over here in the settings. 
we have to go back, scroll down and navigate to general, keep scrolling down and navigate to transfer or reset iPhone, tap on reset and we have to go for reset network settings, tap on it and go for reset network settings. After trying with this, most probably, as far as I'm concerned, this particular stuff will be helping guys in, in my knowledge in most cases because the recent network settings did work it for many of these kind of issues so you can try this out. The last one is all about we have to reset the Wi-Fi. So just go over here. Now go to the Wi-Fi once again. Now what we need to just tap over here in this eye icon. Now from here we just need to keep scrolling down. You have to keep scrolling down and you have to uh, you can try uh, removing, oh, there is called forget this network, remove it, for, tap on forget this network, so that once again you have to connect it back, which means you have to try connect it back, giving the, you have to connect it back to this particular one, that is FTTH 290908954, you have to give the passcode, give the passcode, after the passcode is given, most probably they should be completely fixed. So this will be helping guys when it comes to how to fix the internet is very slow in iPhone 14 Pro, 14 Pro Max and how you can uh, sorry iphone 15 pro and 15 pro max and how you can fix this up i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye